welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are on for the first time, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And for those of you that are continuously coming back each and every time I upload a video, welcome, welcome back. You guys know already that you're on the channel of Birth and Bosses with Felicia. And guys, we have another tr truck DIY that we're going to do today, okay? If you've been following me for a while, then you know that this is a truck that I purchased from Dollar General for 25 cents, okay? It was originally $18 and it was originally a part of the Christmas section, okay? So I've already started to take all of this greenery out that was in the back and I wanted to wait until I started the video to take the remaining of it out. But we're just going to take all of these flowers and greenery out in, up out of the styrofoam, okay? And what we're going to do today, we made one of these on the channel before, but today we're going to do one with a barbecue grill theme, okay? So we've taken all of the flowers out and now all we have is a styrofoam base, okay? Here, you guys, I have picked up some barbecue sauce from my local um, grocery store. I have picked up this sauce bottle from Walmart, and I believe it was 88 cents. Here, I have a grill brush that I got from Dollar General for one penny. And here is some poultry season and some ground sage that I also purchased from Dollar General for a penny. And it does not go out of date until 2023, okay? And we also have a thermometer. That I, a meat thermometer that I got from Dollar General as well for one penny. Okay, so here we have all of these items that we're going to use in this gift basket, um, gift truck, whatever you want to call it. We have only spent um, one, two, about two dollars and sixty cent in total. Okay, by the time I wrap the bow and wrap the bag and put a bow on it, we're gonna say maybe about three dollars and fifty cent for this completed look. Okay, and we will then tell you at the end how much I'm gonna sell it for and um, how much profit I will make. Okay, so here I have some heart scatter hearts that I got from Dollar Tree, and we're just gonna put it on the side of the door of the truck just to bring the Valentine's look into this project, okay? So we're just gonna put a little bit of glue on the side of the heart and put it on the door. Okay, remember guys that details matter, okay? So we have the little hearts on the side of the truck. And now we're going to just start building our gift, okay? Sometimes I just set things up here just to see where I want to have it at. I may move it. I may not move it. We figure all of that out as we go. Just place the items in and see if this is where we're going to leave them. And if it is where we're going to leave them, then we will then come back and glue everything down and tape everything down if this is so where we will leave the items, okay? Okay, I think this is kind of how we're going to do this. Um, so let's go ahead and start to tape our items down. Remember to use transparent tape so that your tape does not show through the item that you are taping, okay? Sometimes I glue the items down. Sometimes I tape them down. It just depends on what project I'm working on, okay? I'm going to put just a dab of glue on the bottom of here. And someone had asked in one of my previous videos um, by me putting the actual glue, doesn't it stop the item from coming up or does it make it hard to come up? And the answer is no. 
hot glue holds the thing stationary, but it's not such a um not such a strong glue that it won't come up. Okay, so all you gotta do is just pull it just a little bit and it'll come right up. Because you wanna have your items so that um I mean have your products inside of your basket so that people will be able to use them. Okay, a lot of times the gift baskets are so cute that people do not want to open them up, but you want to give them the ability to open it up if they so desire, okay? Here is the back side of it. Here is the front side. And I want to put a little bit of glue right here on the side to keep the barbecue sauce in place, okay? Just a little bit. Then we're gonna take the grill, the grill brush, and we're gonna sit it right up in here. Right up against there. Okay, then we have a little hole here. And what we're gonna put there in this hole is, I think I'm gonna put, mm, I wanna say cologne, but I don't really like to mix um, food items with cologne and different things that may penetrate through the package. It probably won't, but just to be on the safe side, I'd rather not do that. So I think we're just going to stick some little candies right there in that opening hole. Yeah, I think we'll do the, we'll do the candy instead of actually putting cologne there, okay? We already have food items, so let's just kind of keep it with the food item thing going, okay? We have some little crackers we're going to stick back there, some Nikot cookies. And then we're going to actually take those items down as well. So here we have a little grill kit. And he can actually snack on his chocolates while he's cooking on the grill. So then we're going to take some shred and just stick in between the holes. Just push it down in between there to cover up any holes that may be showing. Turn this to the side a little bit because I want to be I want you to be able to see what type of bottle this is, okay? I like to keep my wording so that you can see it. If there's wording on the packaging, I like for you to be able to see it. So there's no question what you're getting. I'm just going to keep stuffing it in wherever you can find a spot, okay? completed truck and guys I'm going to wrap it up put some shrink wrap on it and possibly even put it on a platter like I did the one before and I will include a clip or a photo to show you guys what it looked like when I'm done okay thanks for watching make sure you give the video a thumbs up and I really do appreciate it okay boss baby so here is the completed look with the shrink wrap and the bow here is the completed barbecue grill truck unbasket, okay? I know that's a long word. I just made it up, okay? The word unbasket, y'all know y'all hear it here all the time. But all those extra words I just added to it, I just made it up. But anyway, this is the cutest little truck that you ever want to see. This will be great for any um, man that's 
loves to grill on the grill okay this would also be a great father's day gift as well okay all right see you guys on the next video